Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video will be a makeup basket video. I do have my makeup basket off to the side over here. I don't know if you can see me touching it right here. Um, so yeah, let's get straight into the video. I do have some new um, ColourPop Sailor Moon things here. So this will be like the only eyeshadow that I'm pulling for. So since we're in quarantine and stuff, I can wear the bright colors. I want to try to make some neutral looks with this also. So um, just play around with it. So these are the shades here. Um, I love this shade right here for a highlight. I'm sorry about my broken nail there. I'm going to actually fix that. Um, and then this yellow was amazing. And then I like this glitter shade for on the lid and just to give things an extra touch. So let me show you guys what these swatches look like. Those are the swatches. Um, the yellow is super bright and then that rose goldy shade and then the white shimmery light color. Mm. These shadows are so pretty. So I'm I'm very excited to use this. I've dipped into it once and wore every shade, but I believe two. So I can't wait to just see what kind of color combinations I can come up with for this makeup basket. So I won't pull for any others. And then the other two Sailor Moon um, things I have in here are these lip bundles. This is the daylight bundle, and then this is the moonlight bundle. This is what the outer packaging looks like, and I'll take them out of their packaging and show you. And of course, give you swatches. So we have Daylight, which is the lip gloss and the Ultra Body Lip. And these are in the shade Usagi and Moon Tiara. Next, we have the Moonlight Kit. which is in Sailor Moon and Bunhead. So I did swatch it here for you guys. Um, this one over here is Bunhead and Sailor Moon gloss. Then the next one is um, Usagi and Moon Tiara gloss. So these are the four um, lip shades from the Sailor Moon Colourpop collection. And then I do have two new foundations for this makeup basket. Um, I recently bought the Zoeva Authentic Foundation and I got mine in the shade, I think it's 060 Brave. 060 and Brave. And this is what the shade looks like. And I really enjoyed this the one time that I used it. So I will use this some more. And then the other foundation that I recently purchased is the Pure 4-in-1 Love Your Selfie Foundation. I don't think this is my shade. They say it oxidizes. So I have mine in the shade LG6. So hopefully I won't have to lighten this up. But I'll try it one time on its own. I haven't tried it at all. But I will give this guy a go. So these are the two foundations that I'll be wearing. And let's see. And then the other lip options. Let me go ahead and swatch them for you. I have Fenty Candy Venom, which is like this beautiful bright pink. I didn't wear it last makeup basket, so I want to try to make an effort to wear this makeup basket. Then we have O Red. Um, a one red. Don't fall there, tripod. We have a one red by Sephora, and we also have strawberry pop by. Those are colors that I didn't wear, so I want to make an effort to use those guys. And these are what the swatches for those look like. Candy venom on the top. Um, red by Sephora, always red by Sephora. And then strawberry pop there at the bottom. And, of course, I love this blush so much. I'm going to have it again in this rotation. 
This is the diffuse heat by Hourglass, as you can see, I've been using it. I don't know if you can see brush strokes and stuff. It's super pretty, it's this beautiful pink color. So there it is, swatch. This is just like this light baby pink with shimmer throughout it. It gives your face a beautiful flush, like so springy. Love, love, love. So I'm gonna be using this blush along with Project Pan stuff. So anything you don't see in this basket is um, Project Pan things. And then for highlight, you guys, I did recently pick up another, oh my god, Anastasia Nicole Guerrero Glow Kit. So this is what the outer packaging looks like. Mines did come shattered. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna have to repress this guy. But this will be the glow that I'm wearing for this makeup basket. Uh, let me see if I can show you guys. Okay. Uh oh, this little thing fell off. As you see, it's shattered there. But those are the shades there. I'll give you swatches and I'll show you really quickly. The first shade is called Kitty Cat and it's like this light pink. The beautiful, like, I don't know, glow from beyond. That's like one of my favorite shades. And then Forever Young has to be maybe my second fave. Daydream is a good blush topper, which is like an orangey shade. Forever Lit is this beautiful white, so white, almost blue. Then we have Glow Getter, which is more golden tone. And then 143, which is very bronzy. So, here are what the shades look like. Kitty Cat's near my wrist. And then the second shade will be Forever Young. And then the um, peachy shade there is called Daydream. And we have Forever Lit, which is the white. And then the gold shade is called Glow Getter. And then 143 is the bronzy shade. So those are the highlights that I can double into. Those are our lip products. Um, of course, the two foundations. So yeah, that was like a short little makeup basket. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I've been enjoying being in quarantine. You know, social distancing, playing with makeup, not having to worry about wearing neutrally colors and stuff like that. So what? I don't know. Let me know what you guys um, pull for your makeup basket this week. Um, what you guys have been loving, all that jazz. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.